Once upon a time, in a small village nestled in the heart of the countryside, there lived an honest farmer named Jack. Jack was a hard-working man who took great pride in his work and always put his heart and soul into everything he did. He had a small farm that he tended to with love and care, and he was known throughout the village for the quality of his crops and livestock. One sunny day, Jack woke up early to tend to his farm as he always did. He checked on his cows, fed his chickens, and tended to his vegetable garden. As he was walking through the fields, he noticed that one of his crops was not doing well. The soil was dry and the plants were withering away. Jack knew that something had to be done, so he went to the local market to see if he could find a solution. He met a man named Mr. Green, who sold all kinds of fertilizers and chemicals to help farmers improve their crops. He met a man named Mr. Green, who sold all kinds of fertilizers and chemicals to help farmers improve their crops. Mr. Green told Jack that he had just the thing to make his crops grow strong and healthy again. But Jack had always been a farmer who valued honesty and integrity above all else. He knew that using chemicals was not the right way to tend to his crops. He thanked Mr. Green for his offer but politely declined, telling him that he would find a different solution. Jack knew that the key to healthy crops was healthy soil. So he decided to plant some cover crops to help replenish the nutrients in the soil naturally. He also started composting his animal waste and kitchen scraps to create organic fertilizer. It wasn't an easy task, but Jack worked tirelessly every day to make sure his crops were healthy and his animals were happy. One day, Jack received a visit from a man named Mr. Big. Big was the owner of a large industrial farm on the outskirts of the village. Mr. Big was the owner of a large industrial farm on the outskirts of the village. Jack was tempted by the offer, but he knew that selling his farm would mean giving up everything he had worked so hard for. Big didn't like Jack's answer and threatened him, saying that if he didn't sell his farm, he would find a way to drive him out of business. Mr. Big didn't like Jack's answer and threatened him, saying that if he didn't sell his farm, he would find a way to drive him out of business. Mr. Big had the power and resources to make good on his threat, but he refused to give up. One night, Jack woke up to find that his barn had been set on fire. His animals were trapped inside, and the flames were spreading quickly. Jack knew that he had to act fast. He ran to the barn, broke down the door, and managed to save all of his animals just in time. The next day, Jack filed a report with the authorities, but they were unable to find any evidence of foul play. Jack knew that Mr. Big was behind the fire, but he didn't have any proof. So he decided to take matters into his own hands. He went to Mr. Big's farm and confronted him. He told him that he knew he was behind the fire and that he wouldn't back down. Mr. Big just laughed and said that he had the power and resources to crush him, but Jack stood tall and refused to be intimidated. From that day on, Jack knew that he had to work even harder to keep his farm running. He started selling his produce directly to the villagers, building a loyal customer base that appreciated the quality and honesty of his products. He also started teaching other farmers in the village about sustainable farming practices, spreading his knowledge and passion for the land. Years went by, and Jack's farm became a shining example of what an honest and dedicated farmer could achieve. His crops were always healthy.